Hello everyone. Today I have uh, two 2025 uh, planners and I want to go through with you. It's most similar to designs and the only uh, major difference will be the size. And then apparently I guess I like the green. I didn't know that. Uh, both planners are green. And this is going come with this one. Uh, the smaller one is uh, Moleskin 2025 Legendary uh, Notebooks, uh, pocket size. So I'll go over it later. This one is A5 size. Uh, yeah, weekly diary planner and 2025 26 calendar here, and then a year map. Uh, one good thing is um, it has a monthly calendar um, he's a mark so easy to find a, a monthly calendar and one month on two pages and then it's a big enough to write a few um, uh, events uh, per each day a monthly calendar comes first and then a weekly calendars follows and the left hand side Monday through Sunday. So beginning is a Monday and then uh, right side is a blank. This year my planner has a different uh, design and there was no separate space uh, in a weekly calendar and there was an issue that there's no uh, space to write the to-do or um, weekly focus per uh, weekly basis. What I like is uh, it has an each day per week and it has enough space to write weekly to do the weekly focus or weekly reflections and then monthly so it has the same design uh, monthly and then uh, weekly follows okay all the way back to december and after december is done uh, there are a few um, blank pages then you will see here actually I just noticed that when you look at here it has a uh, weekly calendar it has a, a month's name on it I think that's really nice after weekly calendar is over after that there are enough number of uh, blank pages and I, I really like this design we can write uh, yearly resolutions and then goals plan and then we can create our own future calendars 2025 26 27 8 like like 8 to 5 future planning then we can use maybe this two page for our financial status what is a total asset liability and then what is my net worth or shopping list really encouraging um, words or quotes so that uh, we can um, daily or weekly basis we can review or we can write our own uh, affirmations future plans determinations I mean there are so many things we can um, write and there's a uh, holidays but I don't really feel like we need this uh, holidays dates anymore we can uh, find on our uh, phone and then there is a uh, one pocket so this is uh, it's a5 size uh, weekly planner. I really like the design. And then let's go over this one more skin pocket size weekly notebook. Uh, it has a very similar uh, style that 2025 year calendar. And this one, because it is a pocket size, one month in a one page and then of uh, January here and then uh, February here and it's quite uh, small so for example let's uh, say if I write uh, say January 28th birthday right B day well it almost fill up maybe I can write one or maximum two events per day so we may not able to write every event or schedules happening in a one single day and this is a regular, I just got this pen, um, regular, I guess this is 0 0.7 millimeter size. So using a regular pen, you may be able to write one or two events per day. That's about it. And then all monthly calendars comes all the way, all together. And then uh, 2026 year calendar 
here is uh, ideas and goals so we can write a uh, year new year resolutions and then goals and then two pages empty blank pages and then here is interesting is the map it says uh, my inspiring journey to so any country when we travel we can now color the dots and then two more pages a blank weekly planners here same as uh, previous uh, planner design weekly section is on the left hand side the right has a blank page so we can write down to do list I will say to do the what is my uh, focus of this year I mean this week you can write here. so all the weekly planners come and then let's see how many uh, blank pages it has so here year resolution financial status or future planning okay not many actually stickers and then this is alphabets one is a5 size weekly planner and this is a pocket size moleskin the design is very similar and then I always carry a journal book which uh, I write anything everything um, so this one it may last one month or it may last two months it depends on how much I write so this one would last for one year because it's a planner and then this one I have a multiple of journal books a year based on how much I write kind of excited to see next year how it goes with these two planners I hope it's helpful for you to decide what kind of planner you want to select for next year okay thank you I will see you next video bye bye mm -hmm.